European finance minister Olli Rehn says he wants to replace Jose Manuel Barroso at the helm of the EU executive. Rehn made the announcement over the weekend at a gathering of centrist and liberal politicians in London. I'm very motivated to continue to work for reforming and modernizing Europe. Therefore, I'm ready to stand as, as candidate. Guy Verhofstadt, the current leader of the Liberal Party in the European Parliament, will officially announce his interest later this week. The former Belgian Prime Minister is an ardent federalist. The solution is that we are less involved in uh, bureaucratic regulation and that we are more concentrating ourselves on the big challenges of tomorrow. That big challenges like climate change, uh, uh, import of cheap uh, 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 Chinese products, um, um, toxic products coming from the other side of the ocean, uh, migration coming from North Africa. But May's European election results will not decide who gets the job. Under EU treaties, leaders are only obliged to take them into account. 22 of the 28 member states have parties represented in Europe's liberal family. The party leaders will discuss nominees for the next president of the European Commission before the end of the year. But the official announcement of the final candidate will be made on the 1st of February.